Identifying parallel and perpendicular lines from coordinates. Suppose we are given the following. So we have three lines here, and all we know about those lines is we have a pair of points for each line, two pairs of coordinates. So if we're going to determine whether the lines are parallel, perpendicular, or neither, we need to be able to compare the slopes of those lines. And if I want to figure out what the slope of a line is from two pairs of coordinates, I'm going to use the slope formula. So we usually use M for slope, and the slope formula is Y2 minus Y1, or subtract your two Y coordinates in the numerator, and X2 minus X1, or subtract your two X coordinates in the denominator. So I'm just going to go through with each of these pairs of coordinates and use the slope formula. So for line one, okay, uh, my slope is equal to y from my second coordinate, which is the negative 2 right here, minus y from my first coordinate, which is 4, all divided by, now, x from my second coordinate, which is negative 3, minus x from my first coordinate, which is negative 1. Now here, the only thing you have to be careful about is that you include or account for both the minus in the formula and the negative on the number itself. You have to include both. So this is minus negative 1. And when we subtract a negative, that's the same as adding that number. So on top, I have negative 2 minus 4, in the denominator, I could rewrite this as negative 3 plus 1. Now I'm just going to simplify. Negative 2 minus 4 is negative 6. Negative 3 plus 1 is negative 2. And negative 6 divided by negative 2 is positive 3. So the slope of my first line is positive 3. Now I'm just going to repeat that process with my second and third lines. So again, slope formula, y from my second coordinate is 1 minus y from my first coordinate is negative 2. And again, I have to do the minus and the negative here. x from my second coordinate is 0 minus x from my first coordinate is negative 1. So here I have this minus and negative thing twice. Well, this is the same as 1 plus 2, or I could rewrite it as 1 plus 2, and this is the same as 0 plus 1. 1 plus 2 is 3, 0 plus 1 is 1, and 3 divided by 1 is 3. Okay, last one, third line here. I'm going to do the slope formula one more time. So y from my second coordinate is negative 6 minus y from my first coordinate is negative 3 divided by x from my second coordinate is 3 minus x from my first coordinate is negative 6. So I'm going to rewrite the numerator as negative 6 plus 3. I'm going to rewrite the denominator as 3 plus 6. Negative 6 plus 3 in the numerator is negative 3. 3 plus 6 is 9 in the denominator, and that reduces or simplifies to negative 1 third. So there's my three slopes, 3, 3, negative 1 third. So now, I'm going to compare the slopes to determine if the lines are parallel, perpendicular, or neither. So line 1 and line 2, if I look at these two slopes, those slopes are equal. Parallel lines have equal slopes. So those two are parallel. Lines 1 and 3, these two, they're not equal, so they're not parallel. They are, however, opposite reciprocals, okay? One's positive, one's negative, that's the opposite part. And then they're reciprocals, or flipped fractions. This is one-third, this is three over one, right? Or if you take this one and flip it upside down, you would have just three. So opposite reciprocals 
uh, one positive, one negative, and flipped fractions are perpendicular lines. Perpendicular lines have slopes that are opposite reciprocals, okay? Um, lines two and three, same thing. They are opposite reciprocals. So those two are perpendicular.